Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VII. Uh, I made a couple changes, I decided to bring in Kate Sith uh, instead of Eris, just to give him some showtime, I guess. I might as well use him here and there. So he's got all that material, he's got Restore, Steel, Death Blow, Elemental, and Titan. Just to show off Titan, which I'll probably do in the next battle. Um, he's wearing the black microphone, M-phone. Uh, the yellow, you see it's a little lower in attack percentage and just straight up attack power and it's got less slots than the black M phone, so there you go. The cool thing is, is that they're both double, so double growth, so that's excellent. Uh, and also I gave the HP plus materia to Cloud, so that's why his max HP is suddenly a little higher than it was at the end of last video. So there you go. Now, we need to go, and I don't remember where, like, I know where my next, what my next destination is, I just don't remember how to get there. Uh, I don't, I wonder if I'm supposed to go this way. Yeah, I'm going the right way. <laughs> really not even going to use Kate Sith that much, but like, Let's just say I'm going to change him out in the next town. Oh, we got these guys with the Grand Punch. That's great. These guys are excellent for learning uh, Limit Breaks, if I hadn't already said so. Uh, let's show off Titan. Anger of the land. I love being able to say that. Nice. See, I'm okay with wasting the MP there because, I'm, like I said, I'm gonna switch him out uh, when we get to the town, anyhow. So, not right away, but yeah. This town is what we want. Let's dismount and walk. Hey, it's Nibelheim! Awesome! Cloud's hometown. What? This is why I brought Tifa, because she gets a little extra dialogue, I think. This was all supposed to be burnt down, right? Well, it was five years ago, sweetie. They probably rebuilt it. Come on, now. I thought so. Then why? My house is still there, too. Cloud, maybe you were just dreaming? I don't think so. I'm not lying. I remember the intense heat of the flames. Yeah, and Tifa remembers it too, so... I, I don't get why they're freaking out about it being rebuilt. I mean, the place was... I mean, it was five years ago. Come on now. No, it's just a cat. Um, well, let's start exploring some of these places. Let's go into the inn. You gonna say anything? Hi, welcome. What's your story? This town was supposed to have been burnt down five years ago. What the hell is going on? Sir, don't say such awful things. I was born and raised in this town. What you say never happened. Wait, what? You're lying! Excuse me? That's so rude. If you're going to talk like that to me, I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Okay. Born and raised in this town, yet he doesn't remember the... What the heck is that? Man in a black cape? He has a tattoo number six. Hmm? He has something. I got a luck source. Uh, must go to reunion. Reunion? That's really creepy. That's all he's gonna say. That's really creepy. You can't. You probably can't even see him very well, but yeah, it's a dude in a black cl cloak. In fact, you can't even see the man's face. It just looks like a black blob. That's really creepy, and now he's, he's saying he has to go to the reunion. I wonder what the reunion is. I guess he just, uh, he's gonna go to his family reunion, maybe, and he doesn't want people to see his face because he doesn't like his in-laws? I don't know. I mean, probably nothing important. At least I got a look source out of him. Except he had a tattoo with a number on it. Seems to be a thing. Didn't that dude in uh, Midgar have one? Uh, which house do I want to go into? 
Oh yeah, this is the one where he was like, I don't remember coming here. What? Oh, items. Okay. You're not gonna talk to me, you're just gonna... Okay. For some reason I thought this person would talk to you. Is there anything else around here? See, we couldn't explore this place in Cloud Story. Nice town, huh? We've been in the business for a long time. You're lying. Do you have anything to do with this town? Or do you have anything that happened to do with being in this town? Look at that. Messed up. Uh, nope, I guess not. Nothing. Oh, yeah? But then if I say, uh... How about being born and raised here? I was here until I was 14, and I'll remember you. It's not nice to lie. Huh. Okay, this is kind of weird now. Oh, there's another dude in a black black cape. He has a tattoo of the number 12. Hmm? He has something. Got an elixir! Can you hear the voice of Sephiroth? Oh, crap. They got something to do with Sephiroth. That's all he's going to say. Anything? I don't think there's anything else. Alright, let's see. This should be Cloud's house. Yep. What do you say? What is it? I want to hear your story. I lived in this house until I was 14. No, but this town was burned down. Are you sick? Saying those things. Get out of here! Huh. This is really strange. So, well, I remember the first time I played this and I got here, I was like, wait, so did Cloud, like, dream all that? Yeah, kind of. Uh, what house do I want to go into? Because, like, I don't want to go into Tifa's house just yet. See, that's Tifa's house. I ignore anything you saw in there. I don't want to go there just quite yet. It's not a big deal. I just, I'd rather go here first. Uh, what's in here? There's nobody in here, so... Ah, oh, but I can go up here. Oh, ew, there's two of them. Those guys are creepy. Reunion. Yeah. <laughs> what do you say? To, oh, got a luck source. Okay. Okay, so I don't know what these dudes are. Very, very strange. What is going on with this town? We'll check out the mansion later. Let's just go in here. In Tifa's house. Oh, there's one right there. Oh, gosh, he's moving, too. Must get it and bring to Sephiroth. Then become one with Sephiroth. This guy's number five. Huh. Interesting... So they want to get something and take it to Sephiroth. He has a tattoo of the number 11. And I got a turbo weather. Must go reunion. Yeah, 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 I know. You want to go to the reunion. It must be a pretty big reunion because uh, all your buddies that look exactly like you keep talking about it. Okay, oh, there's another dude. Come on, buddy. Tattoo number four. Got a platinum fist! Where are you, great Sephiroth? Alright, I think platinum fist is for Tifa, if I'm not mistaken. It is, and it is double growth sweetness, and she's gonna keep all the materia that was on the Tiger Fang because it's the same amount of slots. It's just not as good as the Tiger Fang. But it is double growth. Uh, hang on a second. I uh, got a text message. Okay. Nothing important. Okay. What materia is she wearing? Yeah, I don't really care about all that stuff. It, it can stay there as long as it wants, so uh, I'm not even going to bother giving her the Platinum Fist. No, I wanted to go into her room. Uh, 
Which one do I look? Can I can I look through her drawer? No, I can't look through her drawer. Can I read her letter? Let's read her letter. There we go. Oh, this ain't the same letter. Periodic report to Professor Hojo. One clone activity report. Unfortunately, no clones have left this town this quarter. As previously reported, the clones seem to be sensing something, but all they say is reunion or Sephiroth and show no other signs of activity. So that must be those guys in the black capes. They're clones of something. What are they clones of? Two, confidentiality report. A total of eight people have visited this town this quarter. Fortunately, none knew about the incident five years ago. Therefore, no one knows that the town was restored exactly as it was five years ago. Our staff, disguised as townspeople, have improved their acting skills and we do not report any problems at this time. That is all. Okay, so now that explains both situations there. Well, we still don't know what the clones are, what, what are they clones of, but we know now that the Nihilheim incident did in fact occur. Cat Cloud's not going nuts. At least I don't think he's going nuts. And uh, so Shinra just kind of they're trying to make it look like it never happened. I mean, let's face it, Sephiroth was, like, soldier's number one officer. It's probably, the whole Sephiroth incident's probably pretty embarrassing to Shinra, so... They probably want to deny that it ever happened. The piano! I can... But I definitely remember playing the piano back then. Why didn't it get burned down? Because this is a special piano. Uh, I see if I can remember how to do this. Um... Now, how did this go? I remember. It was start button to finish, start button to end. Um, let's see. I have to play the same melody again. The uh, oh, the world, the world map melody, the main theme. So it's. Uh, oh, I screwed up. Let's try it again. Go for it. How did this go? I forgot. Okay. All right. Maybe. I, maybe I can do this. Yeah. 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 He's gonna say the same thing. I remember. Start. Ah, screwed it up. I wonder what this is. Tifa's secret savings. One gill came out of the keyboard. Oh! Oh, maybe you're only supposed to play the da -na 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 -na. I thought you were supposed to play the whole thing. But, uh, yeah, you get one gill out of that. So, basically, you could, theoretically, play this thing a million times and get a million gill if you really wanted to. But, I mean, you know, who has that amount of time? But you could play this thing over and over and over again and get a piece of, get a gill every single time. So you could stock up your gill if you had that kind of time and dedication. I'm not going to do that because there's no way that's even worth it. But it's just kind of interesting. All right, let's get out of here. We've we've wasted enough time here. Oh, dang. There's more of those guys. The great Sephiroth is near. Inside. Inside the mansion. The great Sephiroth. Sephiroth was in the mansion. That was five years ago. Wah! He's calling. Sephiroth is calling. Alright, let's go inside the mansion. Oh gosh, this spooky music. Alright, now I have to remember what I'm supposed to do in here. So I'm going to pause real quick. All right, um, I, I think I should be able to do this. First thing we want to do is go left. There is a piece of paper right here. Let's read it. I must get rid of all those that stand in the way of my research, even that one from the Turks. 
I scientifically altered him and put him to sleep in the basement. If you want to find him, then search the area. But this is merely a game I thought of. It is not necessary for you to participate if you don't want to. There seems to be another letter. Okay, this is all optional, what I'm doing here. This does not need to be done in the game, but I'm going to do it anyway. Move the dial on the safe carefully, but quickly. You have 20 seconds. You cannot go past the numbers while turning. The four hints for the numbers are dial one, two, and three. Let's, uh, let's, uh, dial one, the lid of the box with the most oxygen. Dial two, I'm safe freezing because if you, um, if you read the letter again, you'll have to read the whole thing again. I don't feel like sitting through that. Dial two is behind the ivory short of T and Ray. Okay. Uh, dial three. The creek in the floor near the chair on the second floor. Then to the left five steps, up nine steps, left two steps, and up six steps. Got all that good. Because... Oh my gosh, there's an empty space right here. The fourth row has been written in invisible ink. Invisible ink? Okay. Dial four is right 97. There you go. Actually, you know what? Let me just um, quickly, don't worry about that. I'm going to actually write all this down so I don't forget it. It's a combination lock, just so you know. So first we've got right 97. That's dial number four. All right, now let's run up in here. So it says, I must get rid of all those who stand in the way of my research, even that one from the Turks. I scientifically altered him and put him to sleep here. Interesting. Um, let's go over here. Well, I see a piano. That must be where the ivory, so uh, let's search for it. Something is written on the floor. Two, left, ten. Let me write that down. Uh, all right. All right, so we got two numbers for the combination. I could play the piano, but I'm not going to. Uh, let's go here. Got Twin Viper. What is Twin Viper again? But, oh, it's a weapon for uh, Yuffie. Okay. She's not in my party right now, so... Okay. Uh, oh! Battle! What do we got here? I don't know how you say that. I remember this enemy being kind of annoying. Good job, Kate Sith. Now I remember why I don't like Kate's... Oh, I did do Death Blow, so I guess I can't really get too upset. Nice! Alright, let's see. Can't go there. Uh, how do I get... Oh my gosh! Oh, not these guys. These guys are freaky because they can confuse you. Dorky face. Oh boy, funny breath. Ooh, what do they? What do they do? They missed everybody. Let's kill these guys as quickly as we can. Curses. Okay, Kate Sith has been silenced. I don't really care about that. Tifa's gonna be silenced. That's gonna be annoying. Let's just kill these guys as quickly as we can. Good job, Kate Sith. Hate your guts. Alright. I know those guys can confuse you. Let's heal up with Kate Sith. I don't care about his MP. Alright, I'm guessing... Oh, man... Yeah, I remember the encounter right in here is pretty insane. Yeah, I don't care about that. T 
takes three of us to kill one. Oh boy, funny breath. Don't confuse anybody, please. You confused Tifa, that's bad. Thankfully, she's out of it. She unconfused herself. Yeah, we don't want confused. Oh, yeah, I go in here. Oh. There we go. There, There's how I get that chest. And it is a silver megaphone. How good is that? That is... Uh, yeah. It's worse on the attack power, and it's normal instead of double growth. But look how many slots that is. So you can put more materia there, but I don't think that's any... Any, uh... Big deal. Nothing else here. We want to go up the stairs. Uh, I want to... I got game facts out, so... I want to go right. Though I thought I would want to go left. Whatever. Uh, oh yeah, no, I definitely want to go right. Uh, so, let's go up here. And fight a battle. Oh, this guy again. Thanks for covering, Tifa. Thanks for missing, Kate Sith. Oh, you know what? Tifa's about to run out of HP. Yeah, this thing gets off of his stupid whatever. No, let's, uh, let's cure up Tifa. There we go. Oh boy, what's he about to do? Ah, you suck. Ah. Uh. Yeah, whatever. Should be a limit break for Kate Sith. Ah. Uh. He hasn't even learned his second limit break. That's, that's embarrassing. Alright, let's check this out. Magic source! Yay! Uh... Oh, wait. I just realized um, you're supposed to examine the ground before you enter the door. Uh... So, hang on a second. Oh, dang it. Hang on a second. I got it. Um, I'm gonna fight a battle here. Like that. And we have... A Mirage. Let's go ahead and use the dice. Take out that thing. There we go. Get a big number, Kate said. Get a big number. That's not a very big number. I'd like to kill these guys quickly. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. He's in the back row, so I'm not gonna do a whole lot of damage, but Tifa just got her limit break, so that's great. Uh, ah, suck. Why couldn't, why couldn't, why couldn't I do a limit break properly? Alright, let's uh, cure up because we took another beating. Mm -mm -mm. Something is written on the floor. Three, right 59. Yeah, you're supposed to examine the ground as you walk. So, right 59. That's number three. So, I'm missing the, the first one. 
which is back here somewhere. There it is. Wait, what was that? Oh, right, I'm supposed to do the thing. You're supposed to, um... All right, hang on a second, I'm confused. All right, so this is where I found right 59. You actually go down here, and you go left into this room, and there's a chest right there contains an enemy launcher. Uh, which is the enemy launcher? Oh, it's a weapon for, uh, Barrett. That's cool. Uh, but now if you examine the chest again, something's written on the back of the lid. Right 36. So we got our three dials. We have right 36, left 10, right 59, and right 97. So that's our combination. We'll need to remember that for later. Is there anything back here? I don't reckon so. Alright, now I'm going to save here and I'm going to pause real quick. I'm doing a lot of pausing, but just bear with me. Alright, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give Kate Sith the uh, poison materia. I think that'll actually be a good idea. Uh, just just cause. Now let's examine this safe. I have a bad feeling about this. And we still want to open the safe? Well basically, let me just explain. All those combinations we got, um, we're going to have to uh, enter all those combinations into this safe. We will have 20 seconds to do that. And when uh, the 20 seconds runs out, you have to redo it. And you can't, if you go over one number, you can't go back. So. Let's see if we can do this. Um, so, uh, yeah. And remember, this safe is completely optional. You don't have to do this in the game, but it's something I want to do. So let's say open the safe. All right, right 36. Uh, I'm wasting time. I didn't get it this time. T left 10, uh, right 59. I'm not going to get it. And right, 97, 97, 97, 97. Oh, I went too far. I went past 97 and it went to 98. Dang it, I would have done it too. Let's try it again. Let's open the safe. Right, 36. It helps if you have all this written down. Left, 10. And it was right, 59. Oh, boy. And right, 97. Right, 97, I can do this. Oh, it did it again! Crap! Why does... Oh, my gosh. I, I tap the right button, and it goes over 7. Uh, whatever. Try it again. 36. Uh, I went too far anyway. So, let's just wait for this thing to run out. Because I done went too far. But I'll show you. See, if, I might as well practice getting 90, 97 down. Oh, they, see there? I landed right on it. I panicked fail. Alright, try it again. Right 36. Left 10. Right 59. Ah! Let me wait for it to go down. I might have to cut to when I do get it. Right 36. Yeah. Reload state. Right 36. Left 10. Right 59. Right 97. We did it. Success. Let me save. You get a boss fight. This is a this is a tricky boss fight. Uh, lost number. Let's go ahead and cast Big Guard because he does a lot of damage. Ow. Let's go for um, Bio. That's why I have all that equipped. The magic equipped. 
what's he going to do? Let's go ahead and use White Wind. So it's our best way of healing without having to use... Because it goes through the barrier. Because remember, when you heal yourself after using Big Guard, uh, the dam or the amount you heal will not do as good be because of the barrier you got. So let's concentrate on physical attacks for right now. Getting in poison is really good, though. Let's see, we've got a limit break. All right, let's do it. Let's concentrate with physical attacks and limit breaks. This boss fight is weird. Um, okay, I'm not too worried about that. Uh, okay, see, now he's purple. And, uh, let's see. Okay, he's purple now, which means physical attacks won't really hurt him. We need to do magic attacks. Big magic attacks like Aqua Lung and Beta. Uh, so Aqua Lung's good. Let's try Beta. Ow, that hurts so bad. Did he take out Tifa? He sure did take out Tifa. Let's reload. I don't want to lose anybody. Okay, I beat him with everybody standing, but just freaking barely. And we got uh, Cloud's next limit break, Kimmer, Chimmer Hazard. And we got Cosmo Memory. Alright, let's take a look at this stuff. Uh, well, first off, yeah, Klimmer Hazard, whatever. That's his next, uh, yeah, attacks one opponent. Anyway, what is that, Cosmo Memory? I think I know what Cosmo Memory is. Learn Limit Skill Cosmo Memory. It's a limit break. Don't really care. I've got the wrong person. It's got nothing to do with me. This is actually Red 13's final limit break. Uh, it, well, uh, I think it's his final limit. It might, it was somebody's final limit break. I, Cosmo makes me think Red 13. I could be wrong. Li final limit breaks in this game are very interesting. You actually acquire them as items and you f give them to the correct person and you can't just give it to them they have to have learned all their other limit breaks in order for you to be able to do it this time we're still going to be fighting battles so I want to go ahead and cure everybody up 
Man, we took a beating. I don't know if there's any way I can uh, heal up. That sure would be nice. Um, anyway, let's examine the safe. We got the key to the basement. Sweet. And we also got this piece of materia. Odin materia. Um, for right now, let's get out of here. I want to uh, heal up. Yeah, I'm gonna stay at the inn because, man, that I take a beating. Can can I talk to you, buddy? Yeah, give me a room. Yeah, 100 kilo. That's that's fine. Boy, that boss fight was annoying. It took me several times to do it. But he like he. Yeah, just it's an annoying fight. So. Just pay close attention to what I did that last time. and Hopefully you should be able to beat him. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and give this uh, new piece of materia to, uh, to Odin. I'll probably just show it off in a battle, maybe. It'll be overkill, but why not? So back here at the basement. Or in the mansion. So we got the key to the basement. I don't know what that's all about. There's, a, there's another enemy skill I can learn here. I kind of like to learn it, but whatever. Let's go. Okay, what do we got? Oh, these guys. Oh, we got we got uh, freaking bats. Uh, who's that gonna hit? Didn't hit anybody. I want to summon Odin. Okay, nobody's been hit. Let's see what... Steel Bladed Sword! I just want to see what Odin does. This will probably be overkill, but... Well, there you go. There he is! Does he do his insta kill move? So it hit all but one of them. Ah! Failed at the limit breaks. That sucks. I want Tifa to learn her next limit break. Well, she leveled, leveled up in cover. Uh, whatever. That sucks. I don't know why I'm messing up on her limit break so much. Okay, so he does the Zantet Zoo Quinn, I suppose. Anyway. Oh, no, wait a minute. I don't remember this music. Uh Got. What the heck is that? Th oh, I hate this thing. Uh, Ying. I remember this thing being annoying. Ow! Snake eyes. You suck. S sadistic attack? Don't kill Tifa. Let's cure two Tifa. I missed again. Don't hit Tifa. Please don't hit Tifa. Hit Kate Sip. Thank you for hitting Kate Sip. Oh my gosh. I think you're supposed to use fire on these guys if I'm not mistaken because they're like undead. Uh... Kate Sip? Oh, Tifa took the blows anyway. It's just attack, death blow. Might have to reload state. I forgot how annoying this guy is. I'll probably have to use a white wind. Ow! Yeah, let's get a white wind going. At least I got yeah that time. That was more like it. Is he dead? I think like half of them's dead. No, he's, he's still alive. I don't know. This Yang's happy. 
What does this mean? Why do I... Why am I nervous? When Yang's happy, I'm scared. Oh, if he hits Tifa, she's dead. He sure did. Alright, let's, let's reload. This is going bad. Oh, I have to do all this again? Crap. Oh my gosh. This is not going very well. Uh, I'm not going to show Odin. I've already shown it. Uh, yeah, do that. At least we did that. I'll probably use Odin next time I run into that guy. Whatever. Oh yeah, the new enemy was Black Bat. Yeah, so there you go. Go crazy with him. Bat enemies have always been annoying because they're so hard to hit and they do their stupid little blood suck move. Yeah, they're annoying. Thankfully, they don't have a lot of HP. Change of plans. We're going to give Kate Sith fire magic. Because I'm thinking that stupid whatever I ran into was a undead deal. So, uh... Oh yeah, do this one. I tend to not like this mansion very much. All right, what do we got now? Oh, he's he's in the back row this time. Uh, no, not so much. Let's just go ahead and let's just go ahead and use. Oh, I can't even use Big Guard. Oh, I can't even use Beta on him. How bad is that going to hurt? Sadistic attack. Let's use beta. See how well fire does on him. Yes! So I killed like part of them. Now the other part's still alive. I think half of them is magic and the other half is physical. Yang's excited. Oh boy. I'm worried then. Oh, uh, see, I think this part needs to only be hit by physical attacks. Could be wrong. So if I can ever get one of these idiots to go... What's he gonna do? Bolt 2. I don't know how this guy works. I really don't. That pretty, pretty badly hurt. And I kind of need Cloud not to die on me. Yang's happy, oh boy. Last time he was happy, he killed somebody. Let's cure up Cloud. And let's use Climber Hazard, whatever it's called. What are you going to do? gonna happen. Booyah! And he's dead. Phew! That was freaky. Let's go ahead and cure. Alright. Save, so I don't have to keep doing all that. So now this was the room that was locked. Now it's open because I have the key to the basement. Like I said, you don't have to get the key to the basement, but you can. What's in here? To wake me from the nightmare. Who is it? Who is that? Never seen you before. You must leave. You were having a nightmare. Who the heck is that? How bad was your dream? Hmm. <laughs> a nightmare? My long sleep has given me time to atone. What are you saying? I have nothing to say to strangers. Get out. This mansion is the beginning of your nightmare. 
You can say that again. Hmm? What do you know? Uh, don't say a thing? I see. Then I'll return to my nightmare. What if I talk to him again? What? More? Yeah, let's talk about Sephiroth. Like you said, this mansion is the beginning of a nightmare. No, it's not a dream. It's for real. Sephiroth has lost his mind. He found the secrets hidden in this mansion. Sephiroth! You know Sephiroth? You know Sephiroth! Oh, dude, he can fly. You start first. Well, what had happened was... That's how it was. So Sephiroth knows he was created five years ago, and about the Genova Project. He was missing, but has just recently appeared. He has taken many lives, and is seeking the Promised Land. Maybe this, this is probably Cloud talking. I don't know who's talking. Now it's your turn. Sorry, I cannot speak. Hmm, I'm disappointed. Hearing your stories has added upon me yet another sin. More nightmares shall come to me now, more than I previously had. Now, please leave. Oh, can I talk to him again? You're still here. Who are you? At least tell us your name. I was with the Shinra Manufacturing Department in Administrative in Administrative Research, otherwise known as the Turks. Oh, and his name is Vincent. I get to name him. Sweetness. I didn't want to do that. Uh, Vincent. Vincent. The Turks? Formerly of the Turks. I have no affiliation with Shinra now. And you. Cloud, formerly of Soldier. You were also with Shinra. And do you know Lucretia? Who? Lucretia. I don't know who that is. The woman who gave birth to Sephiroth. Gave birth? Wasn't Genova Sephiroth's mother? That isn't completely wrong, but just a theory. He was born from a beautiful lady. That lady was Lucretia. She was an assistant to Professor Gast of the Genova Project. Beautiful Lucretia. A human experiment? There was no way to cancel the experiment. I couldn't stop her. That was my sin. I let the one I loved, the one I respected most, face the worst. Wait, he loved her? Don't tell me he's Sephiroth's father. No, just to be clear, just to tell you right off the head, right now, I don't think it's really spoilers, I'll just go ahead and tell you right now, this guy is not Sephiroth's father. So the punishment was sleep? That's weird. Well, he's gonna go back to sleep again. Let me sleep. That's all we, we can really do. I thought we were gonna get him into our party since we named him. Whatever. Let's get in here. Oh, is there anything down here? C, Project Specimen B, Code C. A scratch left by a fingernail inside the beaker. Let's get out of here. Huh. And C, Project A, Code Z. A scratch left by a fingernail inside the breaker. Beaker. Feeding time. That's our chance. So two specimens were held here, and I guess they escaped. I wonder what that's all about. What's going on here? Oh my gosh, there he is. Sephiroth! Being here brings back memories. Are you going to participate in the reunion? So, he knows about the reunion too. I don't even know what a reunion is. Genova will be at the reunion. Genova will join the reunion. Becoming a calamity from the skies. Genova, a calamity from the skies? You mean she wasn't an ancient? I don't know how you got that. I guess because ancient was supposed to be from the earth and she's from the sky. I see. I don't think you have the right to participate. I will go north past Mount Nibel. If you wish to find out, then follow. Reunion? Calamity from the skies? Oh, goodness. And he's gone. Oh, I'm controlling him now. Got destruct materia, which is 
de barrier, de spell, and death. I don't care about that kind of stuff. Anything up here? And the creepy music starts. This creepy music, by the way, is Vincent's theme, just in case you weren't sure. I don't think there's anything we can read here. Uh, uh, these whereabouts? Ah. So they lost. This is their specimens that vanished. They're prisoners, if you will. We'll learn more about that way later on. Let's get out of this mansion. It's a dead end here. Mount Night. Oh my gosh. I want out of this mansion. We got more bats. Uh, I'm just gonna cast Aqua Lung just to take. I'm just gonna cast Barry Beta just to take care of them all in one shot. There we go. I'm gonna rest up at the end, so. We got a vampire fang. Let's get out of here. Wait! Oh, it's Vincent. If I go with you, will I meet Hojo? I don't know, but we're after him and Sephiroth, so I guess sooner or later. Lucretia. Alright, I've decided to go with you. What? You're coming with us? Being a former Turks, I may not be of I may be of help to you. Alright then. So he's gonna be with us. Sweet. Um I'll bring him into the party later on. Because obviously I'll have to uh, use the PHS. So what I will do. Cause I didn't de-equipmentize Kate Sith. And I still got these nut jobs to deal with. More bats! Oh, a back attack, sweet. Uh, let's cast beta. The team got her limit break. Well, she'll use it in the next video, I suppose. Okay. Alright, let's continue on out of here. Here. So yeah, Vincent is a com my gosh. Vincent is a completely optional character. You don't have to get him. Oh, this doodad. Bleh. Don't ask me how old he is because like it's weird. Like he's supposed to like technically be in his like forties, I think. But then like the body he has is not really his own body because. I guess Hojo scientifically altered him. And that body's like in the 20s, so I don't know what his deal, like, I think, I don't know if he's like undead or if he's a vampire or so, he's something like that. Like, he was human and then now he's like in a body that's like zombified or something. I don't quite understand. They didn't really explain it too well. We'll, ex they ex we'll explain why it happened later on, but right now we don't really know. Thank, thank you, Kate Sith. Still didn't get Tifa's next limit break. Let's go down. Get out of here. And I'm not gonna bother talking to these numb nuts. Let's get in here. Give me a room. Now let's go. Let's go outside onto the world map. So, well, first off, let's de equipmentize this dude. And, uh, PHS, let's bring in Vincent. I'll keep Tifa. Oh, Vincent. Or do I want to keep Tifa? You know what? I don't. I'm going to switch out. I'm going to bring in... Uh, 
I'm going to bring in Barrett. Just for grins. Um. Enemy launcher. Eh, I guess I'll, I'll get, yeah, I guess so. Uh, raise of strength. Uh, and for this dude, he's got the quick silver. Vincent has uh, guns, just straight up guns. So that's cool. But remember that peacemaker? I got the peacemaker. Now uh, you see, attack percentage is like 118. Um, I don't remember. I think. See, it's a better weapon than that, and it's double growth. I think the attack percentage, because of it being so high, the death blow material will, has a better chance that it will work. So I'm going to give him death blow, as well as. Oh no, this is interesting. As well as, I think, restore all. If I can find that all material that I wanted to. Yeah, yeah, do that. Oh, and he's got a silver armlet on, so there you go. I'd rather give him a platinum bangle. Just for a... No, I think I really do need to give him silver armlets. They're... Platinum bangles, although they're awesome as far as growth, they are starting to show their age, so... We're gonna have to deal with normal growth. Um... Raise the spirit. Uh, let's do all the other stuff. Um... Let's see, elemental. And added effects. This is all good. Uh, for this dude. Let's give him a silver armlet as well. And for Barrett, I will give him. I'll give him that. No. Oh, that's all he's got. Oops. Hmm. That's fine. Then I'll give him a platinum bangle and give him a silver armlet. That way, the materia that Cloud has, like these two, They'll be in double growth. The all being in double growth will be absolute priority, of course, so that's good. So Barrett can have... He can have all that. He can have... Oh, let's see. He can have... He can have... I reckon... Fire. Enemy skill. MP, MP plus and cover. I think that's all I really care for him. And then in the next video... Actually, I wanted to save. In the next video, we'll actually go to Mount Nibel. That's where Sephiroth was headed, so we'll do that. And then, yeah. Alright, so in the next video, we'll follow Sephiroth to Mount Nibel. Until then, I'm 480 volts. See you later.